It is too much for you to handle, and I want you to know that I am here to collect all of that weight and to remove that pain. I love you. I love you. I know how hard it was for you to pull yourself out of your dark situation. I know the toll that it took on you mentally. I am happy for you because you trusted me, and together we got through it. God says, Seek me, not the pleasures of the world. I bring happiness. This world will disappoint you. Please turn to me. I don't want you to hurt anymore. Amen. You are going to receive help from the name of the Lord in whom you trust. Carry his name with pride and joy. He will certainly love you for carrying him wherever you go. The Lord is indeed your helper. God says, I see a wave of glory that's about to come over us in the last week of May. The power of God is going to wash over many and touch you in very personal ways. Glory to God. We need to be very careful when it comes to relationships, friendships, if we choose to be around people who do not believe or respect God, we risk our own walk with God and even our good habits. Thanks to thank God. God stands with us through our difficulties. He supports us and watches over us. So today, be courageous in the face of uncertainty and have faith that He will show up in our lives to save us. Be aware of the people you call friends. Are they bringing you closer to me? or are they getting you further? Separate yourself from them if they are leading you further from me because the further you are from me, the more you will feel lost and alone in this world. I will heal you. I will make the impossible possible in your life. Don't give up your faith in me. I won't let you down. I will provide what you need at the perfect time. Your time is not my time, so be patient because I will provide. God says, stop bringing yourself down. Stop saying you can't do it. Stop being negative. I created you. You are wonderful, brave, and powerful. My child, life is full of happy and sad moments. I need you to dwell on the good moments. When bad times arise, life is not all that bad. It is filled with wonders. I need you to keep your head up. I love you. God says, I cannot live without you. I cannot continue without you. You've been so good to me. Today, I want to ask you for strength. This month has been tough, but I have faith that you will restore me. I love you. God himself will be with you, no matter where you go, no matter where you are. Jesus is always there with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. The love of God will fill you. He will be with you just like a father to lead you. You are never alone. When God's Spirit dwells in you, you are no longer an ordinary person. His Spirit transforms you to be the salt of the earth. When you welcome God to dwell in your life, He will guide you in all the ways of your life. When you pray to God, the gift of healing operates in you and brings compassion in you. And then love begins to flow from you as you pray for healing for your neighbor, family, loved ones. God will hear your prayer. God says people can say that you are worthless, but I'll never say that. People can bring you down, but I never will. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.